Hey folks, this is Dan Bell with Intrigen. Uh, thanks for attending this video. And today we're going to look at managing an opportunity record and creating a quote. Let's dig right in here. I am logged into my Dynamics for Sales environment here and I am on my dashboard page here. What I'm gonna do is work with an opportunity record that I created in a previous video. And we'll do that by first clicking on opportunities in the navigation. And the record from previously was this Dynamics Business Central deployment. Go ahead and click on that. And that opens up that record from previous. And you remember uh, previously, we were basically gonna demonstrate the product to them. And if they liked the product, uh, we sent out an email thanking them for the demonstration. And subsequently, we were gonna send out a proposal. A proposal. Uh, what we wanna do at this particular point in time is create the quote for that. All right, so what we're gonna do is navigate to the quotes tab. Currently don't have a quote in here. Therefore, we're gonna click on new quote over here. And once we do that, we can see some processing. And then there is the quote record. Notice it up there. Quote ID, revision ID, the owner, the name of the quote, the currency price list. Over here on the right, you can see we have the reference to the opportunity. We also have the reference to the account or the potential customer. And the other thing we notice here is that we have a product section, but we currently have no products and we're gonna take care of that now. Let's go ahead and add a product here. Brings up the quick create quote product. And what we're doing is we're creating a uh, product for this particular quote, the Dynamics Business Central Deployment. And we have a couple options. We can select existing products or write in products. And we're gonna choose the latter. So the first line item is gonna be the actual deployment itself. And that's gonna be $30,000. Uh, we're gonna leave all the other items here. You can add a manual. A discount if you want to you can put in the tax you can put a delivery date salesperson so there is other metadata that can be captured here we're going to save and close now we can see we have one line item here captured right so that's going to be the central deployment we do want to track and uh, capture another item here so we're going to go ahead and have to add another product here let's go ahead and click add again again it's going to be a write-in dynamics business central training and the price per unit will be 10,000 there. Again, the same opportunity to capture metadata. We're gonna save. And then uh, one more line item here. Again, it's gonna be a write-in. Dynamics 365 managed services. That's gonna have a price per unit of 10,000 as well. Same opportunity for metadata. All three items now entered into the system. You can see them there. The uh, culmination of all those three items comes to $50,000. In this detail section, you'll also notice that you have the opportunity to enter in discounts, either hard you know, coded or you know, just a manually entered amount or a percentage. We're gonna enter a 3% discount here. Watch, when we save the record, you'll notice that the discount is implemented. It brings down the overall cost of this quote to 485. Uh, we can enter some shipping information as well, right? So if it was something we were sending, we could do that. Um, Payment terms are necessary. Let's go ahead and enter that in. No freight terms here necessary as well. And so again, we have all the other information in here as well. And that's basically what we want to capture for this particular quote. We have the quote itself. We have the line items for the quote. Let's go ahead and save and close. And that brings us back out to the opportunity record. I'm gonna go back out to all the opportunity records and let's go back in again, Dynamics Business Central Deployment. Go to the quotes tab. There's the quote we just created in here. It's still in draft mode because what we have to actually take this opportunity and we would need to publish it to activate it. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and click on it, go into the item. There are the line items we created. Again, the overall price that we put in the system, 50K, 3% discount, 48.5. And there you go, folks. Hopefully this helped and taught you something a little bit about managing an opportunity record, creating that quote. We're gonna go into much more detail in subsequent videos on entering in products and quotes and things of that nature. Uh, this was just meant to give you a quick introduction. Again, my name is Dan Bell with Intergent. Thanks very much for attending. Hope to see you again soon.